So maybe if anyone, may, someone, the very person might need this, might stumble to this, I'll give you just a real time, old school example of what it's inspired. Like actually no, no drugs, no drugs in me, ain't been no drugs in me, no possible way of any other claims that, that Mark or anyone else to claim or you're just hallucinating all this shit. I unsubscribe from Christina something Lopez, the heart alchemist. And yeah, you know, I mean, my favorite, I mean, I, probably my favorite. I mean, it's it like my, I mean, just love her to death. I mean, you know, love her to life. I mean, I mean, I mean, thought I got some real, like, real good information from her and whatnot and all this. And then like, well, you know, I make a, the slaves, you know, as a representative of the slaves, you know, especially the, the children, I make a, a simple practical suggestion well first give them the first step christina let them know they're not spinning on a meaningless ball in a meaningless sea of uh energy data that's pointlessly hurling fleeing away from each other as these as the system has presented them with a you know in their in their cgi solar system give them the first step christina the first step allow the prisoners to take the first step and in great arrogance, now if she slipped it in one of her other videos, obviously, you know, I'm not going to endure senseless time constraints of her, like, like I said, the archaic practices, which she herself, herself suggests we don't have to adhere to those archaic practices of running to the mountains and hiding and all the other, which I then later revealed to you where they were born from. They were born from the cataclysm and the fear of a future cataclysm. That's where they were born from. So there, I've you know, I stumbled into the logic of what of the of the non necessity, but I follow her own advice. She says, if you've outgrown your guides, tell them to return to source. You know that's the way she put it, not me. And you know that they can go ahead to, to to flee, like let them go. Yet when I do that, whether it's her fault or not, I unsubscribe for her, and then I cannot escape her advice, for she is the advertisement in every video I click on, almost every video. It's ridiculous the number of videos I click on where she's the, the, the five-second advertisement I cannot avoid. And I have to endure five seconds of her supposed superiority when she's the one that said return her to source. She's the one suggesting when you've outgrown them, when you're done with them, release them to source. Yet, I'm not blaming her. I'm informing her. Christina whatever Lopez the Heart Alchemist, you, I cannot escape you. I unsubscribe you from you and I can't escape you because something will not allow, something Something is determined that I need five seconds of your uh, advice every time I click on a video. So, you know, you're the one. Yeah, so you connect to your guides and angels and all that shit you talk about and inform them that you're trespassing on my consciousness. Okay. This is your advice. Adhere to your own advice. And I bring this up as an example for like how the, everyone knows how the matrix works and when it gives the rules of the matrix. This is real time what's happening. I'm tired. If I need to subscribe to you again or if you even wanted me to, if you ever wanted me to, is irrelevant. I unsubscribe for you because I'm not being hindered by the limitations of your advice. And the matrix, the realm, whatever will not let me escape you. Now, why is that Christina? Get with your guides and release me from having to endure your limited advice every time I click on a video.